Hello, hi everyone, Shane here, Captain Happy, and this is Skeleti in the Park of Nightmares. Now, Skeleti in the Park of Nightmares is a first person horror adventure game in which you play this little boy, Tom, who's just 8 years old, and unfortunately, he is in this very, very eerie park and he has to escape. Now, the game is available on itch.io and on Game Jolt, so let's check it out together. Uh, wait, first, let me increase the volume and then I'm gonna click play. One second. Let's go. Oh, by the way, the game is in French. I guess the boy just said that what his head hurts. Okay, this I mean this alone is a little bit creepy. Do not enter. The fuck is this supposed to be? A skeleton of a... I don't know. Welcome to Skeletty Park. Down to Skeletty Park, listening to the wind of change. Huh, money! Well, of course, this doesn't look like it's a place where money matters. Park? Park, okay, so that's where the park is. Okay, I mean, okay, it doesn't look that scary, yes, right, maybe, just maybe. Il fait très sombre oh. ici. Uh, what? I wish I knew what he said, but I have no idea. Uh, wait. Okay, I can't open those, but those look like doors though, right? It not, it's not just me. Uh, pourquoi? I think that's uh, like why? Something like that? Uh, moi, maybe? Why me? Whoa, what the fuck is that? What the hell? Oh, that's creepy as. Oh! For some reason, I can't look up. I, like my my vision is limited on the vertical. Huh? Uh, that's weird. That's garage. Export services and repair. Joseph Meyer antique shop. Whoa! What the food? Foodland. So. Okay, Skeleton Park. And. Door is closed. Okay. Uh, let's go to Foodland a little bit. Let's explore. Is this supposed to be like a. Just a pool of water here? That's kind of weird. Dessert Land, Foodland. Huh. I'm seeing a pattern here. Skeletty Volant? Skeletty versus Donut King. Okay. Skeletty or Dancer Fu? I don't know what the fudge this is supposed to be. It's a donut, I think, up here. Yeah, they're donuts. And that's a baguette. <laughs> a coke uh, bottle, uh, like not bottle. I mean a, a can. Okay. This is what. Oh. What the hell? Oh, it's water here now. Huh. So what the fuck did I do? I just flooded this whole thing? I don't get it. Can I unflood it? No, apparently not. Did I just see something go? No. Huh. Okay, so I flooded... Uh, well, desert land. Five. I have no idea what that means. Okay. Maybe this was supposed to be like a thing, like a puzzle where I had to 
flood it and then go and not fall into the water? I don't know. Okay. Let's go to... The, well, sorry, it's desert land. It's not desert land, it's desert land. Sorry. <laughs> I read that. Oh, we have some wind here. Oba de Olivier. La mine. Okay. Can I go here? Uh, nope. This, okay, let's go into the mines. Because it's all flashy. It's all dark here, but I think you can go inside. Yeah, see? Oh, see? And now I can look up still. Okay, good. Uh, do not enter. Is this safe? This does not, not look safe. Okay. So what the fudge is this supposed to be? This doesn't exactly look like a mine now, does it? Looks like a creepy... I don't know. Creepy maze, maybe? Huh. What the hell? Can I pick this up? No. I mean, the the music is like it's it's building up the tension. I don't know what 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 does that mean exactly. Like, is something gonna just jump at me or what? I don't know. Yeah, maybe it is a maze. Hello? What the fudge is it? Oh. Whoa, what the fudge? What the hell? Okay, that's scary. Oh, fudge, okay. Whoa. Oh, no, okay, okay, so we are actually being chased now. What the fudge is this supposed to be, though? Okay, alright. Alright. Do I have to go back? Is that thing still chasing me? That's... Oh yeah, it is. Can I go out? City mine. Oh. Okay. That was weird. That was freaking weird. Okay, let's get a fudge out of the mines. And... Again, I can't... Look up anymore. Okay. So there was a monster in the mine, and I I activated a lever, which I have no idea what it does. It this. Well, it still didn't open. See, this one's still closed. All right, let's see what we got here. Period features. Why is it so dark in here? I need some lights in here. What's this place? Can I go up here? Kinda. Hello? Control. Uh, oh. Uvrida Skeleti Island? Oh, okay. So I think this, this thing will. Okay. Right, so this opened the doors to Skeleti Island. Okay, maybe I should have come there first. Okay. Skeleti Island. Oh, of course, in the darkness. Okay. Huh. I, I hope this game is gonna get an an English translation. Oh, this is like a love boat thing, you know, like a ton of love. No, right. Oh, come on. Why can't I? Wait. Can I go up? No. Why can't I get into the boat? 
Oh, come on. Isn't this like a love boat thing? I guess not. Alright, so I can't go there, apparently. I don't know. That's weird. Huh. Let me see here. Creepy. Creepy doll. Come on, go up. Alright, that is creepy. Can I go back though? Or am I going to drown in here? No, okay. FC Pictures. The developers. Whoa! What the fuck? What the fuck is that thing now? That's weird now, isn't it? What the hell are you, dude? Okay. What the fuck is this supposed to be? What's this? Four more... Ah... Uh, Skeletty land. Booga 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 booga! <laughs> what the fuck? Tom? Wow, Drew. 82. Wait, so I was the one who died? Finn? Okay, so that was the end of part one. So... So... Tom was dead? So I was dead, I guess. Okay, so... Yeah, everyone, that was part one of Skeletty in the Park of Nightmares. Um, it's not a very long game, it's, you know, we take maybe take 10 minutes, but um, I mean, I definitely like the visual style. It, I think it sets the game apart. I'm not, I mean, it's not, not too horror. I guess it has a few, you know, scary moments where, you know, monsters are chasing you, but um, hopefully there's gonna be more interactivity in part two and, and, and more freedom to look around, you know. Vertically at least on the vertex, so because that was a little bit weird where you know that whole part I couldn't look up and You know my my vision was fixed uh, At least on one axis, but um, but yeah check out uh, Skeletty in the park of nightmares everyone it is available as I mentioned for free on itch.io and on game jolt uh, You can play it on Windows powered by the unity engine and yeah, uh, maybe leave some feedback Say what you like what you didn't like and uh, yeah, we should wait for part two Hopefully coming soon. So again, everyone, that was Skeletty in the Park of Nightmares. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up really quick. And if you like what I do here, consider subscribing. That would be actually immensely, immensely helpful. If you could subscribe, tell other people about the channel, spread the word. Check out the back catalog too, because I have over 2170 videos. So there's something for everyone on the channel. There's tons and tons of cool games, mostly indie games, to discover on there. And then if you can, take half a minute to see the ways to which you can support me. Also in the description, uh, all that. Uh, it's um, You can either give me a direct donation through PayPal or you can support me with the purchases that you make on the Epic Games Store, the Humble Store, Fanatical. All you have to do, to, to do in those cases is either use an affiliate link or a creator tag. It doesn't cost you anything extra, so it's a win-win-win-win situation. It, uh, everybody wins if, uh, if you use those. And um, the Brave Browser. Check it out, download it through the referral link. You know, install it, and if you end up liking it, I get a small crypto reward. I think you're gonna be pleasantly impressed by it. It's a browser that's based on Chromium, so it's gonna be very familiar if you use Chrome or if you use Opera. And um, it's a browser that puts a lot of emphasis on, you know, privacy. It has a built-in ad blocker, it blocks trackers, and they also have some really cool ideas, the people there, about creating a new ad, ad ecosystem in which you get rewarded for the ads that you are willing to look at, right? So you, you can choose to not look at any ads uh, or you can choose to look at some and get part of the money that's made from you viewing that ad compared to, you know, every other instance where, you know, when you click on ads, um, X or Y company gets all the money and you know, um, you know, makes all the profits and you just get an ad. So, you know, check it out the Brave Browser, link in the description. Thanks so much again, everyone, for watching. And until the next time we see each other, have an awesome day.